helping those who served our country. That's the goal with today's discussion on mental health services for veterans. Good morning and thanks for joining us for News 10 Today at 11. I'm Taylor Gatoni. Today, the Michigan Department of Military and Veterans Affairs is holding a roundtable discussion to discuss suicide prevention among our veterans in Lansing. And that is where we find News 10's Riley Connell live out in Lansing with the latest. Good morning, Riley. Good morning, Taylor. We are coming to you live from inside the Romney building in downtown Lansing, where just through the doors behind me, a roundtable discussion on veteran suicide prevention is still ongoing. So far, we've heard from several state leaders, including Lieutenant Governor Garland Gilchrist and the director of the Michigan Veterans Affairs Agency, Adam Ollier. They're saying that providing sufficient mental health services for veterans and their families is at the center of this discussion. Ollier started off the conversation by saying there are about 650,000 veterans across the state of Michigan. He says the first step to suicide prevention is finding out who and where those individuals are. There's also some discussion about providing mental health services for those service members who are members of the LGBTQ plus community. I'll tell you a little bit more about this discussion and what some of these state leaders hope to achieve when you join us for our 90 minutes of news. Until then, I'm Riley Connell, live in Lansing, News 10.